a little something about Turkey. You have been a source of all many versions of spirituality and spiritual practices way back in the dawn of time for human culture as you know it today. But there is another philosophy emerging there. It won't have words or text as you would expect it to have, but it will be entirely to do with motion. The very young will do it first. And while this is happening all over the world and is truly a global phenomena, people in Turkey will take it for what it is, since you have this history of uh, acknowledging philosophies and religions. You will see very often motions, not unlike this. Done by the very young, for instance, and other uh, gestures for which there will seemingly be a path of communication, interaction, and a noticeable method of living. I'm not only counting on you to uh, recognize this as something other than an anomaly. But I believe that you have the resources, both philosophically and spiritually, to make a global statement in some way that this is a way of being, and not simply an anomaly seen in the very young. I believe that your philosophers and teachers are preparing such a statement and it will be seen in uh, print as well as in uh, other form this year. So, Now, I'd also like to talk a little bit about Malaysia. You have a great deal of earth motion there, and there's not much you can do about that. There is other reminders that you are on a living planet. However, I'm going to recommend that if you can organize this even on a casual level, that June 1st would be a good day to uh, stand with your legs slightly separated, your arms out to the side, fully extended with your palms down and your fingers splayed somewhat like this. Put your arms out to the side of your bodies. And uh, lean your heads back and look at the sun, just glance at it, not right at it. Glance in the direction of the sun, if you would. And ask that the sun interact with the earth to allow calmer conditions for Malaysia in all ways. Do this also during the cycle of the moon that day, even if it is cloudy and raining. It's best to do it outdoors, but if you have to do it indoors or on a parapet, that is acceptable. You recognize that these are not just predictions, but also suggestions. I will do that in the course of the predictions at times. Now, another thing for Malaysia you will notice on the faces of the very young greater humor than you have seen before. Unexpectedly 
many children under the age of five will start smiling. It will be a cheeriness not seen before in Malaysia. Don't discourage it, okay? It's a herald of good things to come.